Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the Void. I'm Player One, and welcome back to Yakuza Zero. Now you may be wondering, why isn't uh, why isn't this the finale yet? Well, don't want to do it yet. Um, basically. So I'm going to do some loose ends, or you know, just. A fuller sense of completion before we finish the story. So we're gonna start here as Kiryu and um, do this. There we go. Raise all shops to rank S. And so now, real estate is fully done. Real estate is completely done. So that's uh, basically all of our money now very easily able to be gotten. Even though there, there is a use for money, but it's not as important as it was before. But you know, it's, it's good to have this now. All right. So yeah, if we check completion list. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Kiryu's business is done. Yeah, and that's all that we're doing as Kiryu for right now. Also, I discovered you can do this. the The save point in your business lets you also change characters, so you don't have to do that run. All the time. I wish I knew that before. Yeah, so now we're Majumno. And he's got a few more stuff we could do. So first, going to go out here. Also, no, I will not be fighting Amon. No, no. Because, yeah, no. I'm gonna have to prepare for all that. Get like good equipment and yeah. It's just not the time for a trot now. While Mad Dog is cool, I definitely feel like it could have more. Because really, this is it. You want to finish any of your combos to then do that, like, rush move. And it comes with one heat action. So. It could have more. So, the first thing that came to my mind is we can finish his money bags. So I'm going to go do that. Basically, most of the, like, I would say substantial things we have left is, um, Amon. And then all the friendships. 
because Kiryu's friendships are done, but not Majima's. So let's go ahead and finish money bags. Oh. Oh, he broke. I, I, really? 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 I need... I need to invest. Oh. Hello, Mr. Nobito. For, for, to finish Mr. Libido, I think we have to go back to Ganhara. Alright, I guess I'll... Maybe this'll reset him? And I believe I'm broke because I did the, um... The upgrades, we were doing it in the Amon fight, and now I've done them now, so they're permanent. So let me see if this will reset him, and then I can take Kiryu's money, and then finish his friendship. God damn it. Actually, no. I have an idea. Since the only thing we've done so far is, um, collect with Kiryu, I'm just gonna reload. I'll be right back. And we're back. Yeah, so now we get this whole thing. Get financing. There we go. That's more like it. Now I will invest. <laughs> yeah, this this money bags is just like I'm, I'm stupid. I want to be friends. And there we go. He befriended Mr. Moneybags. And then they went to have dinner. Great, great friendship. That's one Majima friendship down. Let's see. Also, what um, what am I missing from here? Gold hostess, partner with shops. Okay, and I know exactly what those are. We have one more hostess, which is a friendship, and two more shops, which are also friendships. So Majima literally just has that. So Mr. Libido, the doll girl, the barkeep, and the Sega girl. And that's all that he has. So... Hmm. Well, we are closest to the doll girl, so let me see if I can do all that. I got all of the, um... The crane game prizes I needed first. So hopefully I can just immediately do all of her story. Still staring at that chestnut the squirrel doll? Yeah, I am. I have one of those. Ah, fine. Here. Wow, it's a red chestnut the squirrel. It's adorable. Yeah? Well, it ain't exactly my thing, so why don't you keep it? Really? Thanks, sir. I never got a present from anyone besides my mom before. Best day ever. That's so. I'm well, glad you like it. Now, will you get on home? Yeah, I'm gonna tell my mom all about it. Thanks, sir. Bye. 
Well, this game's a handful. It was kind of nice to make your day like that. And so then we enter a place and then leave. And she's back. It's that girl from the other day, you know, two seconds ago. You back, kiddo? I told you it's dangerous to hang around here alone. Hey, sir. How about you drop the sir thing, huh? I almost got you hanging around here now. Come on now, speak up when somebody asks you a question. Look at the blue chestnut squirrel doll. What? Now it's the blue one you got your eyes on. Yeah, the blue chestnut is super cute too. You say so. Got your head set on that now? No. You got me one the other day, and I'm happy to have it. I'm not greedy. I don't have a daddy. My mommy's at work all the time, and she says there's no money for frivolous things. So I just wanted to come look at it. Well, you ought to head home soon. I don't want your mom worrying about you, do you? I know. I just want to look at it a little longer, then I'll go home. Every second you stick around this part of town, you risk too much, kiddo. The only way to keep her safe is to grab that squirrel and I get a chance. Which I already did. Boink. Wow, it's a blue chestnut. You take care. Squirrels ain't my thing. Really? I can't believe it. Everyone's gonna be so jealous when I show them at school tomorrow. Jealous of that little thing? Yeah, the other kids always talk about their daddies buying them dolls and they show them to each other. I get left out whenever that happens. But now I have something to talk about. I'm glad for you, Scamp. But I ain't your daddy. Mm, I wouldn't really know, but don't daddies buy things for kids? I suppose it depends, but that's a dad thing, yeah? I knew it, so if I did have a daddy, he'd be kinda like you, right? Eh? How do you figure? Because you gave me two dolls. Eh, I did, but... See? You look old enough to be a daddy, so you're just like a daddy to me. How does this kid think I am? I wish you could be my real daddy, sir. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You know that ain't gonna happen, right? Well, can I just call you daddy then? Say what? You don't want me to. Uh... Now, if I was in this position... Nah. Just call me by my name. You gotta show respect to your elders. How about using my proper name? Majima-san. Majima-san. That's better. Ugh. I wouldn't hurt her feelings. This has got to be so damn hard. Call me whatever you want. I don't care. Really? Yeah, I like daddy best. Then. I'm getting some mixed feelings here, kiddo. You best get back to your mom. Okay, bye daddy. You take care on your way home. Yeah, that would, that would give me the heebie-jeebies. If Majima isn't old enough to be a dad, I sure as hell am. Am not. It's the girl again. Which one is it now? Ah. You scared me. You really got an eye for these dolls, don't you? It's just... The pink Unchan looks really pretty. Pretty or not, didn't I tell you how dangerous this area can get? You're not looking for trouble, are you? No. I'm sorry. Here we go again. Pink Bunchan, huh? I'll see if I can get her one. And I did. Boink. Wow, a real Pink Bunchan. Thank you so much. Say, how come you like dolls so much? Oh, I'm just all alone and I'm home. Having my squirrels around feels like I have friends over. That's why dolls are the best. Yeah? That's nice. And now Bunchan gets to join the family. Thanks for everything. I'm gonna take such good care of him. Yeah, yeah. Off you go, back to your mom. Bye-bye. Maybe now the tea party's complete. No reason for her to hang around here anymore. You would think, right? But no, there's still one more bit to the story.
Oh, and she's crying. <laughs> huh? What the? It's that doll girl bawling her eyes out. What's the matter, Scamp? Huh? What is this? The doll I gave you got all messed up. Who did this? I want names. My mom. My mom. My mom's gonna get killed. What? The scary men who come to take money showed up. And this time they took her away. And they did this. And they did this to your doll, huh? Do you have any idea where they took your mom? Down by the river, I think. Alright. Come on, kiddo. We gotta bust a move. Well, shit. Didn't expect it to go that direction. Stop it. I already paid you back everything I borrowed. What are you talking about, you dozy cow? We lent you a million yen, remember? But I paid it all back by the due date. Are you really that dense? You ain't paid a drop of the interest yet. <laughs> by my calculation, that's about 13 million yen left to pay. And we want it back now. 13 million? I could never. Yeah. Guess you leave us no choice then. You're young enough still. Should earn us plenty of cash out on the street. No. And I know plenty of sickos who paid ton- Okay. Yuck. What? Can't- Those are the terms of the deal. You work for us until every last yen is paid back. Got it? <laughs> Yuck. Leave her alone. My daughter. She's the only family I have left. Please. At least spare her. Please. Hey, get her out of here. Could be out in front of that arcade like usual. Gotcha. Oh. No need for that. Huh? And who are you? You ain't here to give us lip about the way we do business, are ya? Hmm? Yeah. I don't give a flying shit about your business. You can do whatever the hell you want. Then you're smarter than you look. Why don't you leave a kid to scram them? Yeah, that ain't gonna happen. See, there's two types of people in this world that really set me off. Aww. Dipshits who tear up dolls I went through a lot of trouble to get a hold of. And fuckwits who prey on defenseless women because it makes them feel big. You fit both those bills, asshole. Huh? What? You motherfucker. Huh? You gotta screw loose, you skinny runt, because you're begging to get your neck broke. Shut your mouth and put up your fist so I can hurry up and beat the shit out of you. And you know where we are, right? These fuckos are going in the drink. If they live long enough. Oh yeah, he ain't going, even gonna live. Let's give him a good old wachooing. The good old wababoom. I don't even know what you would call that. Is that a flying drop kick? He does like a spin too. Mm. Hey, I ain't done with it yet. I still gotta tear up as badly as you tore up that poor doll. Have mercy. Come on. I was just getting to the fun part. Daddy. Hey, you alright? Hmm? Dad. Yeah, this is the man who bought me all the dolls, Mommy. I call him Daddy. Oh, so that was you. My daughter talks about you all the time. Um, I don't suppose I could ask your name. Sure, it's Majima. Majima-san? You've done so much for us. I don't know how to thank you. It was nothing, really. This is a little token of my appreciation. Please accept it. Okay, that's going to the box. Appreciate it, lady. Daddy. I'm sorry. What's wrong, scamp? I told you I'd take good care of the dolls, but please don't be mad at me. Why would I be mad at you? It ain't your fault. Don't even sweat it. But... Listen. Even with its eye coming off and cuts all over, it ain't like it's dead. Its heart's still beating. I can feel it. 
Really? Yeah. Heck, I'm living proof, ain't I? Take a look. One eye's gone, but I'm doing just fine. <laughs> You're right. When Bunchan got messed up, you didn't throw it away, right? You're still clutching it close. Looks pretty happy about that, if you ask me. Really? I'm gonna fix him up and keep him safe, then. Yeah, you do that. I better get going. Thank you for everything, Machima-san. Thanks, Daddy. Daddy. <laughs> it's got a nice ring to it. Yeah. Huh. <laughs> that, um... Yeah, that, that doesn't go anywhere, right? Right? Huh. Alright. Anyway... Now that that's done, I want to finish Mr. Libido now. Where is Gandhara? Isn't it like all the way? Yeah, it's all the way down there. Okay. Okay, right there. And before I go in, I, I'll uh, I'll check the list to see which video I haven't clicked on yet. Cause that is technically also part of the list. You have to see every video. Uh, let's see here. Completed items, video clips. Oh, they got all the uh, the hostesses now. We shouldn't have all the videos yet. We shouldn't. Yeah, there's... Four more. Hmm. I don't know who that could be. I'm thinking of one. One is the, the Sega girl, right? But then who are the other three? Alright, Miss Libido's not here yet, so I'm just going to keep go. Keep going. Places like these are, uh, are very weird, right? It's not just me. Like, you come to a place to pay to watch a sexy video. Now, while it um, doesn't show it in the game, I'm pretty sure these are the full blown videos, if you know what I mean. And it just seems like a weird business. Now, I guess it makes sense in, um, in this time period, because the internet basically doesn't exist right now. But as soon as the internet arrives, yeah, these places die immediately. Oh, that's 15 clips. Alright. Mr. Libido. There we go. There we go. I haven't seen that Mr. Libido guy around lately. Brother. <laughs> ah, long time no see. What's the matter? Stomach pains? I can't. I can't get it up. Need a hand? No, 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 no. I can get up just fine. I can't get it up. You? Really? Since I last saw you, I've been cutting back on the parlors and clubs and stuff. Then before I knew it, my mojo was just gone. Well, that's what kept you going. Ain't no shock your strength's failing you when you go without your three meals a day. Yeah, I shouldn't have held back. I need to go see some girls. You ain't going nowhere like that. Head to the hospital and see a doctor instead. Please, brother. Go to the drugstore and get me some of the good stuff. Good stuff? Yeah, it's an emergency supplement called the Incomparable Habu Drink. 
One of those should get me back to normal. An energy drink? You were taking that stuff all along? That explains a lot, actually. You ain't planning on propping yourself up with one of those and going off to a parlor, are you? Push it too far and not getting up will be the last of your worries. It could even kill you. Well, some things are worth putting it all on the line for. That's... I'll be fine. Please bring me the drink. Alright. No use trying to convince you when your mind's made up. If you know what you want, I'll help. Thanks, brother. Alright, where's the drugstore? I need to save him. Don Quixote? Pawn? La Marche? Where is the drugstore? Oh, Jesus, it's on the other side of town! Don't worry, I'm hurrying. You damn bastard. You need it to live. You can't be cutting back on it. You are Mr. Libido. sell a thing called the incomparable habu drink we do actually why really i have to warn you it's very strong that's why we keep it in the back besides there's only one customer who buys it i think i know him but you'd like to buy it too how wonderful it must be to be so young be careful with it as i said it's pretty strong i'm a little scared now however i'll take it thank you sir Thirty thousand? yes sir Now, can I buy more now? Oh, baby, yes, I can. So the incomparable Habu drink is a better Staminin Stam Staminin Royale. It's better. I'm pretty sure it's full health, full heat. It is the best recovery item in the game. And it is quite funny how in order to get this, you have to be friends with Mr. Libido. Alright, I need to save him. I need to save him now. Thanks, you saved me. But I still don't cool fight myself yet. What? Like I said, I got this way because I wasn't vigilant. The beast is untamed. It's gotta be shown who's boss. If I don't break the drought, it'll only be a matter of time before I wilt again. I've gotta pop it off. I get being where it going all, but you gotta know when to listen to your body. Maybe a little break is in order? Who are you to talk? Just how many videos have you watched in those booths since you got hooked? Yeah. Guilty as charge. Still, I get the feeling I've checked off this whole city. I pretty much know every working girl in Soton Bori. There's plenty of guys who'd love to have your problem. You got your favorite girls, right? Just go see them. <laughs> I plan to, of course. Just thinking about it just making me firm up. Oh. Oh. Oh, 
Come on, just get out of here. Go polish your pole somewhere else. Roger that. Thanks so much, brother. You should give that drink a try too. It'll change your love life. He's a perv, sure. But he knows what he wants. He's willing to lay it all on the line to get it. In some weird way, he's his own kind of manly. Maybe working with ladies 24-7 has gotten me to the point where I don't even feel the urge. I gotta start being more honest with myself about my desires. What do you know? I actually learned something from the guy. Godspeed, Mr. Libido. Those energy drinks probably killed you. But Godspeed. Okay. So that just leaves the barkeep and the arcade. But you know what? The only things we get from those are properties for Cabaret. And uh, I don't really feel like doing them right now. They can come later. They're not even that interesting, really. I'm just going to do one more thing. Where? There she is. Uh, yeah, this is the mother. <laughs> And she's now, um, one of our hostesses. That's our last hostess, by the way. She's gold. Dolly. Eh. Eh. Very weird. Very weird, very strange. But there you go. Okay. So, yeah. I think... I think with that, I'll end it there. That's basically... All of the main stuff... That I wanted to do before we beat the game. That brings us to 82% on the completion list, which is pretty damn good. That is pretty damn good for not really focusing on a lot of stuff. I mean, we are at 168 playtime. And we are at 110 parts. But I feel like we could have scrambled longer. Hell. Uh, I'm gonna show- I'm gonna throw a shout out right there real quick. Um, Guard Ezio. He's pretty cool. He's doing all the Yakuza's. And he does 100% as well. And he has... A lot of parts. Now, he is entertaining. So, all the parts are worth it. But... Definitely could've... Slimmed down a little on- on the amount of them. Uh, so yeah. I landed there. I've been player one, and we'll both see you next time when we finally finish the story, Yakuza 0, and then spin the wheel to see what the hell goes in this slot that has been taken up for fucking most of the channel's length. Seriously, this was the fifth series we started. God. Alright. Bye-bye.